just want to go over a little bit of the equipment you need to trap coyotes. I kneel on the ground to usually use a kneeling pad like this to reduce my scent at the location, but mainly to keep my knees off the rocks and out of the stickers. You're going to need a good trap. A MB650 is one that I use. It's a good heavy duty offset jaw trap, four coil springs, but probably more important, it's got three swivels. I like it. Or Jake strap, square jawed, four coil, rubber lined jaws. Again, three swivels with a shock spring in the middle. Those are, as well as the Sterling uh, MJ600 is the three different styles of traps that I use. I normally use rebars stakes, 24 inches long. Sometimes I'll double stake when you got the ground that's soft from moisture or sand. If it's got a lot of clay in it and dry, typically one 24-inch rebar stake will hold, but it's always better to have more stake than what you think you would need. Also, we'll use a sifter. We're going to cover that trap up. Use one that's got a diamond mesh in the bottom. It's got a sharp edge so you can scrape up dirt just to sift over your trap. That sifter keeps your rocks and clods from getting down and interfering with your trap jaws closing. Also use a little trowel digging shovel to dig a dirt hole. Needs to be pretty heavy duty when you're digging in hard ground. Also sometimes I'll, I'll use my hammer to drive the stakes in and it's got a claw welded on the end to chop out a trap bed. It's about the only way you can get one in in the winter when it's frozen is to chop it out. So you can also use the claw pull your stakes. And you're going to need some urine or a food lure or bait, maybe a gland lure, and an attractor. I often use sheep's wool down in the bottom of a dirt hole or I'll tuft it up underneath some grass, stake it down, pin it down with a big gutter spike and use it to hold my lure. If you sprinkle your lure or spread your lure just on the ground, it doesn't seem to last as long. Putting it up in something like a cotton ball or sheep's wool makes your lure last a little bit longer and it lets the air circulate through it. I think it gives you a lot wider distance of, of attractant smells. So that's about all the equipment you need. I, I don't worry about wearing gloves. Uh, if there's a lot of stickers, I'll probably wear gloves or if it's cold. I know there's coyotes are going to smell that I've been around here, but I don't think you can completely eliminate that. And on my years of trapping, I've not seen where um, the odor from humans has really been a deterrent to, to catching coyotes.